Guys, what is going on? It is uh, one o'clock in the morning. Thought I'll give you guys a quick little update on the van project. Uh, today I had a dentist appointment and I had to take some uh, medication, so I wasn't able to work on the van during the day. But now it's one o'clock in the morning, and I figured I'll do a little bit of uh, uh, work on the van because I had a long nap earlier after the dentist. But anyways. Uh, I was checking this uh, heater box right there. The heater box was sitting right here. Uh, this is in the van that I'm fixing, not the parts van. And uh, there was a bracket broken right. Well, I'll show you. This bracket was broken, so I'm trying to use some epoxy glue on it to. Uh, welded back in place with the glue epoxy glue and then also the drain hole tube that goes to the outside for the AC condensation to leak out that one broke as well right here I'm trying to fix that tube because otherwise if the AC is on it's gonna be leaking on the floor and inside the, the van uh, so I had to disconnect the heater hose right there. I had to disconnect the AC pipe. So all the AC, the AC pretty much had to be drained. So I'm gonna have to be. So I'm gonna have to refill the AC later on. Uh, looks like a mess. Yes, I know. So I'm gonna try to fix this. Uh, it's gonna probably take 24 hours to the epoxy to settle in. It's, it's already uh, drying, but it takes about 24 hours to complete, completely, completely harden. And then same thing for the tube in there. After it dries a little bit, I'm gonna put a little more, a little more epoxy around the tube and it should be fine. And yeah, let's go check out the other van real quick, see what's going on there. And this is the other van right here. I'm probably gonna, this is the box that I need. So this is the heater box that I need for that van. Because uh, the other one is broken. So I was thinking to maybe just remove the whole unit. So I don't have to go on separating the two pieces together. Because it's kind of pain in the butt. There's like a bunch of, a bunch of screws holding it here and the bottom. Uh, and so forth. So I might, as, I might as well use this box in here. And then that one, once it dries, I'll put it in the, in the inside of this van. So yeah, that's just a quick uh, little update. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to pretty much take this box, put it in there while, while that one is drying. That way I, I have something to do while it's drying. And uh, once this is in, uh, then I'll be able to put in the reinforcement bar. And then start connecting the wires. Install the steering column and just pretty much start reversing all the panels that are laying around here but i'll get to this uh, tomorrow for now i'm just gonna deal with this uh, ac box so yeah that's my little update on uh, on that uh thanks for watching guys subscribe if you've got any questions let me know if you've got any comments let me know and uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow because tomorrow I'll continue on uh, installing more things on the inside and then uh, I'll have to go to work so I'll try to get up early because I, I didn't work today because of the dentist thing so I was kind of hoping to do a little more but I, I was just beat from uh, I guess from the little medication that they gave me and I was just kind of passed out but yep, uh, that's it for now guys, thanks for watching and we'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs>